Well, hello, hello. Yes, I am in, I have my, I'm in like a parka suit, basically. I've got my puffy coat. I have my gloves. I have my, you know, my blanket on my lap. And yeah, I am indoors right now. You might be thinking, what are you doing? Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Well, it's Tuesday and Monday night about, I think midnight-ish, someone hit a power station thing for the natural gas and the natural gas went out. In our home, we built a new home and we heat with natural gas. So it's Tuesday, it is about 60 degrees in here and I think they have a scheduled maybe to come back online on Wednesday. So I have no hot water, I have no heat, um, but you know what, whatever. I can move around, I'm grateful. It's kind of a little adventure right now. It's not that bad, but it is interesting. And I thought, what a great illustration. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Mm, yeah, we put all of our eggs in one basket and that basket got turned over and dumped out. And so now we are, um, you know, I'm wearing a blanket inside and my parka and my hat and my, my gloves to keep my fingers warm. This relates to lots of stuff. You've probably heard in finance that you don't want to put all your eggs in one basket. Well, it applies here as well, finance or your heater system in your house or in business. Now, I know I may sound like a broken record, but if you have all of your marketing message eggs in one basket, all of your customer uh, communication channel is in one basket, channels, channel is in one basket, AKA Facebook or Instagram, would you be having to wear a parka if they went out? Basically, if Facebook or Instagram is your basket, that's your only way that you are communicating with your customers. What would happen like this? What would happen if your basket fell over? So like I wished, we had a different heat source at this moment. I know that many times my clients wished that they had a, a different channel of communications. I highly recommend email because it comes to the people in their home and it's as personal as you can get. Multiple channels are the best and healthiest and safest route to make sure that your business doesn't get waylaid by someone else. Very, very important lesson for today. So if you just have one channel and you are only relying on social media channels that you do not own, I would highly suggest starting an email database and starting to communicate with your customers in that way as well doesn't take a lot of time. You can repurpose your content, but you're going to be reaching your customers and making your business a little healthier. And it's like insurance, right? Insurance. Make sure you don't have to wear a parka, a virtual business parka. Enjoy this tip of the week. And I hope that you, unlike us, do not put all of your eggs in one basket, especially when it comes to customer engagement and relations. Definitely multiple channels are best. Have a fantastic week. And if you would like a resource, a free resource to check your business's health, there are three areas I find extremely important to make sure that they are very, very healthy and robust uh, in your business. So if you would like that free download, I'll put it down in the link below and you can go nab yourself a copy and get right on it. Have a terrific one.